Hey guys, back at it again with another Sam's Club haul. Mine went blank for a second. Hold on, let me just. This is not wine, this is strawberry watermelon juice. I just need some juice, you know what I'm saying? Um, so, back again with another haul that I quickly wanted to share with you guys. Again, this is something that we did yesterday, but I was pooped and I did not feel like filming yesterday, so I was like, I just cannot wait till the next day, just like last time. You guys seem to love my previous haul, so here I am again. Um, clearly, we bought some different stuff this time. Different stuff was finished, so yes. And guys, if I do seem like tired, out of breath, it's just really because I am. I just hit my third trimester from 28 weeks and I'm really feeling it, so power through it with me, okay? Um, so the first thing we got were paper towels. I don't know about your state, but in the state of Florida, we have a shortage now on paper towels, toilet paper, and water because people are panic buying at the minute. Um, so the reason that this is already open is because I took some out to give to my cousin who's in college, who's in university over here. Um, since we were not allowed to buy two packs. So yeah, this is Members Mark. You know, I love Members Mark. It's Sam's Club's house brand. It's better than Bounty. Like, that's a hill I'll die on. It's better than Bounty. Members Mark toilet paper is better than Scott. Scott, Charmin, whatever else is out there on the market is just better. I just really quickly wanted to show you guys this. I've already opened it. Is it focusing? Yeah, okay, I already opened it. Um, but this was such a great deal. It's four sets, four colors. So two of the cups have regular like spouts that you drink of and then two have straws. Um, they look great. It's made in USA, made in Missouri, hopped on a truck, placed in the store, arrived at your table, recycled to start the new journey. So you can definitely recycle them once, you know, you're done with them after a couple of years, I would assume. It's reusable, food safe, dishwasher safe, microwave safe, PBH free, shadow resistant, recyclable plastic. This was $19.99 for this whole box. So I just quickly wanted to share it with you guys before, before I got rid of the box. Just so you kind of know what it looks like, like the sizing of everything. I have an almost five year old, an almost one year old, so they can both definitely use this. So you have this, this, which is good for um, spaghetti tomorrow actually, and then a smaller bowl like cereal snacks. So yeah, and now that I have a third one on the way, I was like, you can never have too much. Anyways. Okay, so all of a sudden, craving beans. All of a sudden, that's all I can say, all of a sudden. Um, so the black beans, I'm gonna probably eat, you know, with um, chicken and rice with my um, Mexican inspired dishes. And then these beans I'm going to, the pinto beans I'm gonna be using for um, chili. Usually I only use Heinz beans, Heinz beans and tomato sauce that I grew up eating. That's what my dad used to use to make chili, but I cannot seem to find that anywhere. Walmart doesn't have it, Target doesn't have it. I don't know what happened there, but I'm gonna try it with this. Um, on to the next item. This is all pantry stuff. Some tuna to make some tuna salad for sandwiches. Also to put in like a real salad. Um, just wanted that. This. Beef ravioli in pasta sauce. This comes in a 12 can pack. This is going to be for um, Zane for lunches because he really, really likes ravioli. This one has no artificial flavors, no preservatives, no artificial colors. So 
good. We love that. See, my son and my husband went off to the snack aisle and this is what happened. So these are um, fruit snacks. Monster, you know, Halloween inspired. I hope he likes it because he's very peculiar with his fruit snacks. He only eats the Welsh ones. Um, so we'll see if not. Then this, I bought this last time too. It's, I think, a 40, yeah, a 40 pack of Capricorns, also a very good deal. Um, 20 Fruit Punch, 10 Strawberry Kiwi, 10 Pacific Cooler. We have a small fridge upstairs in the playroom slash loft area, so a lot of it goes upstairs. And then I'll probably just keep one of the Fruit Punches downstairs in the refrigerator. All the other stuff is going to go upstairs. I'll leave the produce after and the pantry stuff. Then some organic lemon ginger. Caffeine free herbal tea. This is really good. It's by the brand um, Bigelow. We ran out, so again, we bought it one time months ago and we just ran out. And it's a tea that I can drink multiple times a day. It's really good. It's 60 pack. Then we got two of Rao's homemade uh, marinara sauce. This is our preferred pasta sauce because it's a short ingredient list and it's all stuff you can read and understand um and yeah we like this we go through it a lot because i also make like pizzas on tortillas for zing and so we just go through it a lot so i wanted to this time some other juice is the western georgia peach again something that i got last time we absolutely love this one we bought two packs, so some of it is going downstairs, some of it is going upstairs. A pack of spaghetti, also from the brand Members Mark. It does say imported from Italy, so don't know how that works, but anyways, it has um, six packs in it, and usually we eat one pack, me, my husband, and Idris, and then Zane has um, penne pasta or something else made out of chickpeas or lentils to get that extra extra goodness in. I also got a pack of biscuit pancakes. This is something that I sometimes make for the kids in the morning. Well, not sometimes, it's definitely like a weekly thing. And I just rather use this than to make it from scratch because the only thing that I really like making from scratch is um, crepe, which is the pancakes that we use, well, that we are used to in from Europe. And we just call that pancakes over there. So sometimes when Idris asks, can we have pancakes? I'm like, yeah, do you want our pancakes or American pancakes? It's, it gets confusing, but anyways. We got some Cheerios. We also got some Frosted Flakes. We love cereal in this house. You can say what you want about that. We love cereal. That's all I can say. Idris is the only one that really eats Cheerios. Um, and the baby. Other than that, Frosted Flakes. By the way, fun, fun fact, not so fun fact for me. When I started my pregnancy, which is also another reason why I thought it might be a girl. I had a lot of, not a lot, I had a couple of food, food adversions, adversions, food aversions. Oh my God, sorry guys. So I had a lot of, so in the beginning of my pregnancy, I had some food aversions. Cheerios was one of them. Idris would sit next to me and eat these and I would hurl and almost have to run to the bathroom. This and coffee, disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Ugh, wild. And I heard that is more common when you have girls, so that's why I thought it might also be a girl. It's crazy, guys. This is what happens when you and your husband split up in the store and there's no communication. You buy a new box of Cheez-Its when you still got a huge box of Cheez-Its from the last time you did the shopping. His, in his mind, he said, I thought it was gone, 
and you ask for it sometimes. So I'd rather be safe than sorry. He just does not want to be, you know, it's 1 a.m. and I'm craving cheeses and he has to run to the store, which I totally understand. So then we got some Kleenex. We've been overcoming some um, sinus and allergy issues in the house. So a lot of sneezing going on here. These are great. It comes in little box packs, so you can put them basically anywhere. Um, kills 99.9% .9 of colds and flu virus in the tissue within 15 minutes. So this is great to have during the season, always actually. But you, I want you to be mindful if you're using this, do not wipe your mouth with it, especially if you're using it you know, on your children, because it does have, um, I mean, there's a product in it. Not that, you know, it's, it's poison, but I'm just saying, like, you'll have some residue on your mouth, and it's not that pleasant. This is a big bag of rice that we got last time. Not last time, but last, 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 last time. But I'm using it because I have just got a rice dispenser, so I'm going to transfer it in, and I was like, let me just add that into the haul as well. Got a rice dispenser from Amazon. So you put your rice in here, push here to open up, and then it comes out here. It holds 25 pounds. This is a bag of 50, but we've already been using it, so hopefully everything goes in. We'll find out afterwards. We needed some new wet wipes. Sam's is definitely the spot for um, wet wipes and diapers, all those stuff that you need, you know, obviously everything that you need in bulk, but this is really, really good. Um, it saves a lot of money in the long run. Then when it comes to produce, we got a pack of organic bananas, a okay, pack of avocados, pack of lemons, and a crate of beautiful peaches. Okay, bringing you guys a little bit closer because I do have some stuff in the freezer and refrigerator, just like always. Um, we got a pack of pa pasteurized eggs. Preferably you want pasteurized and organic. This is farm fresh, so I was like, it's gonna be just as good as organic, you know. A pack of grapes, it says seedless, but it definitely has seeds in them, so that's, I mean, I don't mind, but I'm just saying they're not super. Then we have some um, sweet bell peppers, a double pack of OJ. I wanted a double pack because I'm gonna start making some um, more smoothies again. So one is just to drink, the other one is to really just use with um, smoothies. No. Okay, so that was it for the refrigerator. Then for the freezer, we got, oh yeah, we have a three pack. I wanna show you the box, it comes like this. Sorry for all the mess ups up there, it's just real life. It comes in a box, a box like this, it's a three pack of turkey bacon, really good um, money value. Uh, the same price as one pack and a half in the store is this whole box. So I wanna say the whole box is either $5 or $6. Um, and then they come individually wrapped like this, three packs. Okay, then the only other thing we got was this margarita pizza. It's pizza with tomato sauce, cheese, and semi-dried cherry tomatoes. Also a product from Italy. The brand is really good. We tried pizzas from the brand before from Sam's and they're tasty. So that was it. Now I can Put all this stuff away. I'm so hot, like I'm sweating profusely. So now I'm gonna put everything away, start the dishwasher, grab me a slice of cake from Publix, strawberry shortcake, and enjoy some 90 Day Fiance. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Yes, okay. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.